the Ministry of Women Affairs, in collaboration with stakeholders in the education sector, have stressed the need for improved access to education and enrollment for marginalized out-of-school girls. They made the call at an event to mark the International Day of the Girl Child, organized by Talita Kumi Foundation, TCF, an NGO in Abuja. Mrs. Tayo Erinli, TCF Executive Director, decried the increasing number of out-of-school children, particularly the girl child due to COVID-19, insecurity, gender discrimination, and others. Erin Lee, therefore, stressed the need for behavioral change and implementation of policies that would protect the rights of the girl child and ensure cases of abuse or violence against them are addressed. So it's for all of us to have attitudinal change, to know that a girl has a right to life, a girl has a right to education, a girl has a right to health, she has a right to, to speak and to be listened to and to be heard. She has a right to be protected. She has a right to be invested in. If we want that bright future, if we even want our nation to be built, we must invest in our girls because they are the ones who will breed the leaders of tomorrow. Their education level will always affect their, the children that they produce. Mrs. Teresa Mondi, representing the Nigerian Police Gender Dex, reiterated the commitment of the police to ensure all cases of gender-based violence were investigated and prosecuted to ensure justice. We have so many cases this year than last year, and all our girls, most of the uh, uh, survivors are out of school girls, like I say, and that is our concern because if they are in school, they will be able to, they, they have the knowledge and how to protect themselves. But I'm happy with this now, at least they have the knowledge now, to, they will know how to protect themselves and they will know how to defend themselves and they will know where and where to go if there's any uh, molestation. Um, any situation at all that they can report to the police, they can do that. And in our own part, we make sure every perpetrator goes to court. Also, Ms. Amarachi Chuku, Assistant Program Officer, International Federation of Women Lawyers, Abuja Branch, stressed the need to educate the people, especially at the community level, on their rights and the appropriate channels to seek justice. Issue of rape, we still are advocating for special courts for such so that the trial will be speedy and the, the victim or the survivor will get justice on time. Because most of them going to court one year, two years, three years for a particular matter, some of them will drop out and say I'm no longer interested or I don't want to go for it again. So we are still advocating for a special court in, for special cases so that the survivors will be able to get justice on time.